Hey everyone, what's happening? The Hot Master coming at you live on the Facebook from the Man Cave. I just want to have a quick shout out. Ursula, go fuck yourself. Everyone else, how you doing? Anyway, let's get started with today's review. We got a beer from McKellar. They're based out of City Field in Flushing, New York. For all you Mets fans out there, I know my wife Crystal is a diehard Mets fan. Anyway, this one is called uh, Don't Drop That DDH Double Dry Hop. This one comes in at a whopping 9.5% ABV. Double Double Dry Hop New England, New England Style Imperial Pale Ale. Here's the label. It's two people. Just hanging out. Let's go for the pour. Michael didn't hear you. He didn't hear the name. He said, don't drop the what? Michael needs to not listen to loud music. And uh, for the pour, here we go. Can you hear me now, Michael? So we got a good two finger head retention. That's right, two finger. Two fingers are better than one. Anyway, oh, like I said, you got that nice, dark, rich, golden haze. It's almost like someone just took egg yolks and just cracked them in the glass. Let's go in for the uh, smell. So I'm getting a lot of pineapple right on the nose. I'm getting the maltiness, a little booziness. This is a 9.5, so this is normal for these kind of beers. Smells great, looks great. Let's go in for the uh, taste. Oh, that tastes delicious. It's like a party in my mouth. And uh, Do you want live commenting? Because I'll read it. Sure. I, God help me. Mike said, what a beautiful head. Wow, fantastic. Well, thank you very much, Mike. <laughs> you know, there's nothing more important than good head. Retention, oh. of course. Any, anything else you want to repeat before I go into this more? Is that a missing Jeopardy for this? It's Jeopardy. It's on every night. Is it on like five nights a week? This is not on five nights a week. I think it's a small price to pay for your press's Jeopardy. I don't... He doesn't strike me as a Jeopardy type. I am. You are, but I can't see him playing Jeopardy, listening, watching Jeopardy. He's like the kind of person that would actually make fun of Alex Trebek. What else? What else you got for me? What's going on? Uh, Ursula said she'd rather watch J-Lo and Shakira. Obvious reasons. <sighs> well, I mean, that's pretty obvious, but we're not even going to get into that. You know, Ursula, uh, I'm still peeling off all my goddamn googly eyes down here. <laughs> uh, she... I can't read her comment because you'll get mad at me. You can read it afterwards. Okay, we, we, we can do that. But, uh, it, uh, he said, answer in the form of a question, please. <laughs> so, what is good head retention? And uh, we got the golden haze going on, like I said. Uh, great taste. Uh, the booziness is pretty well hidden for a 9.5%. It is there, though. So, you, you know, you can tell it's boozy, but it's not to the point where, like, you won't drink it. It goes down very smooth. It's very enjoyable. Um, I've liked pretty much every McKellar beer I've ever tried. I don't think I've rated anything from McKellar below a, a 375. Um, they make phenomenal beers. So, like I said... Uh, my rating on this would be easily a four out of five. This is a great beer. Um, like I said, it's it's got some booziness to it, but it's very tolerable. It goes down great. You drink a couple of these and you're in the bag for the rest of the night. And uh, once again, here's another close up of the uh, can. I'll take guys who enjoy craft beers for 500, Alex. <laughs> I gotta get a better fan base. I mean, I know I only got like three fans, but I know I can do better than this fan base. Me included, really? No, of course, you not included. So, uh, once again, this has been a Hopmaster live beer review. And this is the uh, Hopmaster 
saying uh, keep on hopping because I know I will.